scanning mobily and transferring the mobile scan into the PC software. Just go ahead and start your scan. You can click this gear icon here. This will allow you to turn off the white LED that flashes. Simply move your scan into position. Look at the gauge on the side. You want to be between the excellent and the good. Then just go ahead and start your scan. You can pause the scan to flip over the item so that you can capture the other corners, edges, sides. So it looks like we got majority of the scan. There's some missing from the top most likely and some from the bottom, but it's good enough for now. We'll go ahead and process the scan. It's finished processing. You can see there's a hole underneath the chin and one in the back of the head. It's fine. We'll transfer it and fix it there in Rebel Scan. What you want to do is remember to disconnect from the scanner's Wi-Fi and connect to the same Wi-Fi that your computer is connected to. From the Rebel Scan main menu, you'd click New Project. Then you go to File, Import from Phone. It'll give you a number. Type the same number on the mobile app, then press enter and it'll start to transfer. Now you can see the model a little bit better, but all of the data imports from the raw data to the fuse point cloud to the mesh model. We'll go up here to the hole fill and we'll just fill the holes. Ideally these large holes would not be here, but this was just a really quick scan. I really would have flipped it over face first so that I could get the back of the model scanned. But it's not a problem for this demonstration. As you can see, the hole fill pretty much mapped everything out pretty good well that's how you transfer a file from the mobile app to the PC app thanks for watching subscribe and enjoy